That encouraging news comes with a new warning from health experts about a rapidly spreading variant of the coronavirus. It's called the Delta variant. It's said to be more contagious and possibly more deadly. And as WBZ's Anna Myler learned, health experts say the vaccine is the best way to protect yourself against it. Dr. Fauci says the Delta variant that was first detected in India now accounts for more than 6% of cases here in the U.S. And he is urging people to get vaccinated to stop it from becoming the dominant strain. It does appear to be more contagious. The Delta variant is taking over as the dominant strain in the U.K., especially among a younger group. Of 12 to 20 year olds, namely that group that we're concerned about here about making sure they get vaccinated. The good news is the vaccines really work, especially two doses against this variant. Um, the bad news is we still have a lot of people that aren't vaccinated. Dr. Shira Darone of Tufts Medical Center says young people who haven't gotten the vaccine yet should. I do think that, you know, people even in that younger 20-something, uh, 30-something age group that might feel like they kind of dodged a bullet as cases Recede, um, do need to think about this potentially new danger to them in, in the form of a highly transmissible variant. Right now, everyone 12 and older can get the Pfizer vaccine, and there is promising news even younger kids will be able to get vaccinated soon. Cambridge based Moderna and Pfizer are testing their vaccine in kids under 12 and are expected to have results for children ages 5 through 11 by September. Pfizer will begin testing the vaccine in infants as young as six months in the coming weeks, and that data could be ready by October or November. The main thing is that the pandemic doesn't end until everyone's protected. Dr. Fauci is reminding people they need to return for a second shot of the Moderna or Pfizer vaccines. And he also says that people who have had COVID should still get vaccinated because the shots provide better protection than immunity from previous infection. Anna Myler, WBZ News.